What's up Multiverse, Dr. Dave here. Welcome to the Geek Lounge. On today's video, we are continuing with our series of Naruto Kai unboxings by opening up the Tier 3 Wave 5 Booster Box. Alright then guys, here we have the Tier 3 Wave 5 Booster Box. I do just want to say before we get started, if you happen to hear any noises, any kind of like hammering, sawing, drilling, anything like that, there is still construction going on next door. It's very annoying, but I do apologise in advance if it does happen to interrupt the video. So yeah, Tier 3 Wave 5, I'm very excited to get into this. Uh, the same with the rest of the boxes in the rest of this series of Naruto Kai unboxings, because I haven't opened up any of them on or off the channel before. This Tier 3 Wave 5, the Tier 4 Wave 5, the Wave 5 X packs and the Tier 2 Wave 6 box as well. I do expect Caillou to announce a new box probably like a couple of weeks after everyone is back from Chinese New Year. But before we get to that, we have this Tier 3 Wave 5 box. As you guys can see, it has a sand design style color with the Kazakagi Gara here on the front. On the sides, we have Tamari and we have Kankuro, if that wasn't already obvious some kanji there on the top and on the back we have all of the legal information but i did want to direct your guys attention to these two things here as you can see up here it states we will get 20 booster packs with five cards in each pack and it does actually give you the ratios here on the box now six out of the 20 packs we get two r cards one and then an additional r card or an r card more on that in just a second uh, and then one sr and one tr or tgr nine out of the 20 packs you get two Two R cards, one SR card, and then either an SSR, a UR, an AR, an MR, an OR, an SP, as well as a TR and TGR. And then five out of the 20 packs, you're guaranteed two R cards, one SR, one SSR, and one TR slash TGR. So at that like unluckiest point, if you didn't happen to pull any kind of URs or above, you're guaranteed 13 SSRs. So what this means here though, what I want to go back to this is where it says you might get one R or NR. It's not, I guess it could be true in a way, but in terms of the pull rates for an NR card, which is the highest rarity card you can pull in a tier three box. I mean, you can only get, I think there's like two in a case of 48, right? So in actual fact, it's probably something like two out of, I mean, I haven't really done the maths in my head. It's got to be somewhere like 900, somewhere between 900 and 1,000 packs, right? So to say you could potentially pull an NR card out of six out of 20 packs, it's not entirely true, but I guess they are saying it could be an R card or an NR card, right? So if you happen to open up six packs that contain three R cards, you know you're definitely not going to get an NR. But anyway, guys, I've waffled on enough. Let me get this box opened up, set up, and then we'll start opening the packs and see what we get. Speaking of packs, we've got 20 to get through. I have counted them to make sure they're all there, and they are, thankfully. I have also drafted in the beautiful calendar that was part of that New Year's gift box that we opened up last week. Again, be sure to check that video out if you haven't already. There is a link to it. There will also be a link to the playlist at the end of this video where you can go and watch all the other videos that we've opened up so far. Every tier, every wave box, as well as every special box, blister packs, X packs, etc. You name it. We have opened it up. Here are some sleeves, probably going a bit overkill there on the sleeves because we probably are only going to get, well, what was it? Like nine out of 20 in terms of like hits, let's say per se, but it's probably going to be something more like seven or eight because we probably are going to get like one or two SSRs uh, in terms of that 9 out of 20. Five guaranteed SSRs, um, as it said on the box as well. Fingers crossed, can we actually pull an NR? That would be absolutely amazing. We probably are going to see some new SRs and SSRs, or at least I say new, maybe you guys have probably seen them before, but will be new to me because like I said, I haven't actually opened up these uh, uh, packs on the channel before. Only tier two wave five box that we've opened up now twice. It was, of course, the last video. Uh, um, there's a link to that if you did want to check it out as well, but there will be a link to that video at the end as well. So then here we have our SR card of a young Sakura. We have our R Kushina, an R of that Sand Village guy whose name I never remember. 
first we have a hit immediately guys it is or but just before we get to that let's check out our chibi card here which is a tr of a young sasuke that's pretty cool i don't think i've seen that one i certainly don't remember it but yeah we're starting off with a bit of a bang here with an or guys what have we pulled we have kakashi reading one of jiraiya's novels sadly i did pull this in the last video well, i say sadly it's like it's cool to get a hit certainly off the bat uh, just a shame when you do get a duplicate but it's going to happen when you open up so many packs but it's still a really cool card i love the gold accents on these or cards um yeah we'll give it like a penny sleeve because i've already got it before and put it in one of those more kind of like premium sleeves but uh there we go uh we'll be up for trade eventually when i get to like the end of the series guys i should also point out when i get to the end of the series i'm not going to be stop opening uh caillou boxes we've still got loads to get through and i'm going to certainly purchase more but um yeah at that point i'm then going to take stock of what i've got see all the duplicates and then yeah certainly some things will be up for trade but uh yeah i'll announce more about that at a later date second pack up here then guys so we have our sr of naruto we have rock lee we have kakashi yeah, it is then just an R here of Naruto. And so our chibi card is a TGR of Mitsuki. I may already have that, but I haven't really taken stock of my chibi cards, to be perfectly honest. Pack number three here, is it going to be the magic number? We have an SR of Kuranai. I did actually pull that one in the last video. It was the first time I'd actually pulled that card. We got Gamakichi, our R card of uh, Hanabi here. What is this? A UR, right? So we do have another hit. Let's get to our chibi card just before that. So we have a TR here of Hokage Naruto. That's pretty cool. Not sure if I do have that one. So yeah, as I said, it is a UR. Is it UR or... No, it's AR, right? Sorry guys, I have to pull this up to my own fate. Yeah, sometimes I can't really see on the very small screen here on the camera. But yeah, we have an AR then. And it is of Zetsu. That's pretty cool. I know I definitely don't have that. And I do love my AR cards. The golds, the reds, the silvers and the blacks. If you constantly watch, you're probably really bored of me saying that. But uh, yeah, look at the detail on that. Zetsu, I have to say though, like one of the most hated characters, isn't he? I really did hate him. Uh, we've got some premium sleeves here that we'll pop this into. These are also from that New Year's gift box very cool you actually got 40 of them two different designs this uh design as well as a one of minato holding uh a like bunch of leaves so let's pop zetsu into that one very cool with the infinite sukiyomi there at the top yeah that's a very cool card so we have actually started pretty well i hope that doesn't mean we're gonna like peak too soon and then have a whole bunch of kind of crappy things opened up uh, towards the end of the video sometimes it happens sometimes it doesn't sometimes it happens in reverse right but uh anyway let's carry on and see what we've got so our sr card is sakura we've got mogi here we've got a young sasuke so this is just another r here then of a young hinata chibi card then is a tgr of boruto i think i may have pulled this one before because i think i did ask the question if he's eating like his favorite food and i think he is right it's like burgers i think that's what i've read still haven't seen boruto though but uh interesting enough now the two packs where we've had uh, um, three R cards. We've actually got a TGR instead. So is is that what's supposed to happen? And by that, I mean, if you get like the three R cards instead of like that super NR card pull, are you then guaranteed a TGR? I guess we'll find out if we don't pull an NR, right? And those uh, packs that have three uh, R's in, if we get TGRs, then I guess that's the way it works. But anyway, here we have an SR of a young Mike guy. We have Sasuke, we have Sakura, perfect pairing there. This is another hit then guys, another OR right. Again, I have to pull it up to my own eyes. It is indeed an OR. We'll check the chibi card first of all, which, oh, I've dropped it. Pardon me, is of Daedara right there, which is pretty cool. Again, not too sure if I've seen that one on one of his clay creations. So then this is OR and it is of Hokage Naruto. And I know I definitely don't have that one in my collection. So that is very, very cool. Again, you can see the gold accents really hold up nicely. Gold kanji there. I don't know if that's like a Rasengan or a Wind Churn, Wind Rasen Churngun, pardon me. No. What am I even say? I'd, you know what, guys? I'm probably embarrassing myself here. Let's just sleeve this thing up um, with my pronunciations and things like that. Win Russen Sharon Sharon. 
no, no, I'm messing it up again. Let me just stop and admire this card because it is a beaut. I was trying to say Windrush and Shuriken and I kept saying Sharingan. I mean, that would be an awesome move, right? If someone could kind of connect those two powers up. But here we go then, guys, with what our sixth pack here, I think. Yeah, sixth. So we have an SR here of Gara and I don't think I've seen that SR, to be honest. That could be a new one for the collection, to be honest. Our Naruto, our Yamato card back here is an R then of that um, samurai guy whose name I never remember. So is this going to be a TGR card? It isn't. So you're actually not still guaranteed a TGR when you do get three uh, R cards in a pack. This is just a TR here of Shikamaru. Pack number seven here. Is it going to be lucky number seven? We have Naruto as our SR card. We have Kankuro. We have Sakura. Hit card there. No, it's just an R, isn't it? It is of a young Naruto. And so our chibi card is of Hinata. A perfect pairing there. May have pulled this one before. Like I said, I haven't gone through my chibi cards in a while, so not entirely sure. And if my maths isn't failing me, that's now four packs where we've had three R cards. So yeah, we've got two more chances than I guess technically at an NR card. So our SR here is of Aruga Sensei, and this doesn't look familiar. I think this might be a new one for me uh, in my SR collection. We have Tamari, we have Udon here. This card then is a UR, guys. So we've got another hit. Chibi card, well, we've got a TGR here then as well. So yeah, I guess there's nothing guaranteed around Chibis, uh, like TRs and TGRs, uh, hits and non-hits, etc. if that does kind of make sense. So this is Inogen, I believe, from uh from boruto the son of uh eno and sai i always thought it was a girl to be perfectly honest but i think i then learned he's actually a boy so you are as i said i don't know why i'm looking at that again you are then is of unko i think her name was unko right who had the curse mark from orochimaru there with that snake that's very cool i know i definitely don't have this card uh so always happy to pull well i'm always happy to get a hit regardless but certainly always happy to get a card new into the collection and this is certainly one of them you are as i kind of just give these sleeves for now to be honest but i'm going to get more kind of premium sleeves as i uh, start to binder up my collection i have binded up like you are or obviously rsr ssr which is weird right because i maybe should have binded up the the more bigger hits but i for some reason haven't but um yeah there we go guys you are like i said of unko i think that's what her name was very cool card ninth pack here guys and i probably am gonna jinx myself but i find it weird i haven't actually pulled an ssr yet but uh we know we're guaranteed five of them at least and uh yeah we've got four hits there so that'll be like another five so we we could potentially pull 10 ssrs now in the rest of this uh these openings which i probably then just jinx myself right hopefully not hopefully we still get like at least another like three hits above ssr but anyway we have an sr here of choji we have konohamaru we have sai we have i'm gonna have to bring it up to my own eyes guys a ui it is another hit so let's do our chibi card though first we have a young hinata looking incredibly cute there just tr though so as i said this is ur i was going to put it in again but we already know it's ur and it is of iruka sensei with a piece of chalk there very very cool again another card that i don't have in my collection so very very happy to pull this and add it to said collection yeah, that's quite a funny one, Iruka with the chalk, uh, of course the teacher, he becomes headmaster I think actually, right, towards the end of the series, um, but yeah, very very cool, uh, really liked him, though the one thing that I was disappointed about was the change in the voice actor for the English dubbing, um, it just sounded really weird when we were so used to the other voice actor, but um, yeah, Still cool character, really like liked him a lot and happy to pull this card. Tenth back here then guys, which puts us at the halfway point. So here we have an SR, well this is definitely an SR that I haven't pulled before. So what is it, Konohamaru with, is that that ninja cat? I can't really remember its name, but I've definitely never pulled this SR before. It's quite unique, quite cool, quite funny. We then have our cards of Naruto, Sasuke. That's kind of a perfect pairing. So this card is a SSR. Uh, we were bound to get one quite soon. So Chibi card there is of Sakura. That kind of completes Team 7 to an extent, right? The SSR card then is of Sasuke in... Was it like State 
two or, or whatever it was, like the curse mark um, that he has from Orochimaru. I don't know the exact name of it. I think it's him anyway, right? I'm pretty certain that's Sasuke. I was just seeing what the symbol was down there. Seems a bit weird, but yeah, I'm absolutely positive that is Sasuke and SSR. And one I definitely know I don't have. I do have, was it like an MR or an OR of this? I think it was an MR actually that I pulled of this kind of similar form, which was very, very cool. But yeah, this one also uh, pretty darn cool. Pack number 11 here, guys. And I'm definitely expecting to pull quite a few SSRs in this second half. Like I said, we were guaranteed five minimum probably going to get six or seven we've only had one so far so we're definitely going to pull at least four more ssrs we've pulled what five hits already and we were guaranteed kind of nine but that also included ssrs so i reckon we're probably only due another two or three um hits kind of you are and above um if i'm not mistaken anyway here we have naruto as our sr card a young choji kind of homaru r this is another ssr we'll check the chibi card first which is a tr of chojo choji's daughter right there so this ssr then is of conan i may have it I may not. I can't entirely remember. I feel I did pull like an SSR of Conan uh, a couple of videos back, but it may have been a different card. Can't entirely remember, but either way, it's still pretty cool. Pack number 12 up next here, guys. We have a young Sasuke as our SR card. I can never remember that character's name. We have Udon. We have another R3 uh, pack here. And I also never remember that guy's name. Our chibi card then. Oh, I almost bent it there. It's actually a TGR of Mike guy. That is pretty cool. I'm not really sure he's... Hold, or is that just the design in the background? I think it is actually. I thought he was holding something for a second there. That's pretty cool. I definitely don't have that one in my collection. Never seen that one before. Pack number 13. Is it going to be lucky or unlucky number 13? And if my maths is correct, we've now hit five packs where we've had at least three R cards in them. So we've only got one more chance at an N R card if we go uh, by the things that were on the back of the box. So the S R card here then is of Neji. We've got one of the sound ninja dudes we have tamari we have an ssr here let's do the chibi card first which is a tr of uh haku i think i think that was the character's name right haku the like zabuza's subordinate i think it was haku i'm absolutely positive it was if i'm not someone will certainly correct me in the comment section below i definitely don't have that card in my collection yeah this was an ssr and it is of sarada uchiha although i definitely know i have pulled this one before pack number 14 up next here guys we have an sr of uh kakashi his name like escaped me there for a second kakashi reading novel kind of goes with that or card uh to an extent right so sr of kakashi r of kakashi R of Choji. This card here is another SSR. I told you we were going to start pulling them. TR is of that cute young Hinata that we've already seen earlier. And the SSR here is of Tamari, and I'm pretty certain I don't have that one. It definitely isn't ringing any bells. Um, I'm guessing the number, yeah, 94. So it's one of the more later SSRs. So yeah, pretty positive I don't have this. Either way, it's a pretty cool card. Pack number 15 here, then, guys. Looks like we've got a duplicate of that Kurenai SR card from earlier so hadn't pulled this before and I've now pulled it three times in two videos one of the sound ninja dudes a baby Gara there this card I th was that R it is indeed guys so sadly we are not going to pull an NR card in this box our hunt for a tier exclusive card rages on still haven't pulled one our TR card here is of Eno we're down to our final five packs guys by the maths we're definitely going to pull two more SSRs for sure we may even pull uh, five SSRs in total we've got what five hits so I think we're definitely going to pull yeah, we've got through our six cards where it's R only. So we're definitely going to pull uh, SSR and above from all of these five remaining packs. Hopefully, though, we do get one or two more hits. So our SR card here is of Choji's father, R of Rock Lee, R of Naruto. Hold the phone. That's another R. I'm pretty sure I've counted six packs already. And it said you should only get six, right? I may have to go through that again. Like I said, my mask could be a little bit off, but I, I'm actually certain I counted five. Ah, oh, wait, was it six or five? 
I, I'm going to have to count through it, guys. I certainly wasn't expecting another R card, though. We'll have to see. We got a TGR again of Mitski. I think we did see that same one earlier. So yeah, guys, I've just recounted, and indeed, there's seven packs where we've got free R cards. So the information on the bottom of those boxes is absolutely horse crap, or maybe there's a factory error, or who knows what. But uh, yeah, I've opened up seven packs that contain three R cards when it said there were only going to be six in there. So... Yeah, a bit annoying. I did also realize when I was recounting that I've actually had four SSRs, so we're definitely guaranteed. Well, <laughs> I say we're definitely guaranteed, are we? Because we've like the numbers on the bottom have been different to what we've pulled. So maybe I just won't bother even reading or following those in the future because it doesn't seem correct if we go by this box. Anyway, SR of uh, Eb Ebisu Sensei is right. Uh, Mogi, that's a pretty good pairing there. We have an R of Neji. We have an SSR up here then. First up, we'll do our TR card, which is of Eno. Uh, once again, we just pulled that one a few seconds ago. SSR then is of Kiba and Akamaru in that kind of beast transformation, whatever the jutsu was called. I did actually pull this card in the last video. Final three packs, without question, they should be SSR and above. I'm hoping though we might at least get one or two more hits. You are are and above but let's see we can't really go by what was on the box because it's already been mistaken so sr of choji's father once again young kakashi we have sai this card is an ssr we'll get to our chibi card first which is of shikamaru i think that was different to the one we saw earlier ssr then is of itachi and you know what I don't think I have that one. I haven't said it for a while. It's actually one of, if not my favorite character. I don't know why I say if not, because he actually is my favorite character. This is when he's about to uh, essentially wipe out the uh, Uchiha clan, right? The Everyone in the village on that kind of chimney in the sky. That's very, very cool. I know I definitely don't have it, like I said, in my collection. So always happy to get a new SSR into the collection. Final two packs then, guys. We really, I, I think I really need to get one more hit. I, I think five from a tier three box would be like the lowest I've ever received, to be perfectly honest. But um, let's see. SR here of Sasuke, and that one doesn't look too familiar to me. Is it a new one? I'm just going to check the number. It's not massively new, right? 88. I'm pretty sure they're in the hundreds now, the SR cards. But uh, I'll certainly have to check that if it is new to collection. Gamma Bunta, Kushina R. We have... No, oh, come on. Really? Another R? Yeah, this. there's something wrong with this box, guys. I know there's been all the rumours that boxes get sorted and what, but... Eight packs containing three R cards. I don't know. I don't know. Something fishy, I feel, is going on with this one. We did get a TGR uh, of Sakura, which is pretty cool. That's got to be like a newer one from Boruto, I think. Um, or is it? Or maybe like the War Arc. Uh, definitely don't have that one in my collection. But yeah, Th this uh, the back of this box, as you guys can see, plain as day, if it does go into focus, that is you know, 1R, 6 out of 20. There's no, yeah, this one doesn't say there's no other R's on either of these two. So 6 out of 20 packs are supposed to contain R cards. I've actually now received 8 out of 20 packs. So something a bit fishy there. That's it. I haven't probably translated this, if that might still say, like, possible still. You know what I mean? Maybe this isn't guaranteed, but uh, I don't know. It kind of I kind of find it find it really weird if you put it on the box then th th that kind of seems a guarantee to me like six nine and five adds up to 20 so that's kind of suggesting to me that that's what you get in this box but uh anyway guys let's stop complaining and get to the last pack we haven't even done an edit here or a cut or anything but here we go then there is the artwork i always kind of say it for the last card but it does just match the box hopefully we get a hit because uh, yeah, I think five hit cards from a tier three box would be my lowest ever from a tier three box. But now that I'm thinking about it, did I see a couple of people say the tier th that this box was like relentless for pulls? Like people said it was quite disappointing. Maybe I could be right. But uh, let's see. Anyway, we got Sarada as our SR, Baby Gara. We have uh, whatever that dude's name is, I can never remember. We have a, our GB card TR of Naruto there with the Rasengan. That's pretty cool. So 
Are we going to finish on a bang? You know what? We are at least. I think it's AR. Yep, I brought it up to my own eyes. Apologies if you hear like a helicopter above going past. We have Kiba and Akamaru, which is pretty cool. I know I definitely don't have that. Very happy to at least finish on a hit. So, yeah, six hits from this Tier 3 Wave 5 box, um, which I think matches what I have got in the past. I think I have got more, maybe like seven or eight even sometimes. But I, I think that's about the correct ratio normally for you are and above. But uh, yeah, gotta say, I'm pretty happy to finish on that one. And well guys, that's all my pulls for this tier three wave five box. Let's just recap the hits that we got. So first up, we have this UR card here of Unko. We also got a UR of Iruka Sensei. We got an OR of Kakashi reading one of Jiraiya's novels, though I did pull that one in the last video. An OR of Hokage Naruto. An AR of Kiba and Akamaru. And an AR of Zet. So I did also pull a few SRs and SSRs that I didn't have in my collection, which is pretty cool, but I don't really know what happened in terms of those number ratios on the bottom. What was it? Eight or oh, like eight packs where I pulled three R cards when supposedly the box suggests it should only have been six. I don't know what happened there. If anyone does know, let me know in the comments section below. But yeah, guys, that is going to do it for today's video. So first and foremost, thank you so much for taking a little bit of time out of your day to spend with me here on the Geek Lounge. It is very much appreciated. And I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If so, be sure to give us a thumbs up. Drop some comments below. If you guys opened up the Tier 3 Wave 5 Booster Box, which pulls did you get? And as always, we have plenty more content on the way for you guys. The next video in this series, if it wasn't obvious already, we will be opening up the Tier 4 Wave 5 Booster Box. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that what is the easiest way to stay tuned you ask is very simple subscribe hit that subscribe button appearing down below and enable those notifications so you don't miss out be sure to check out the last video in the series which was the tier 2 wave 5 box there is also the playlist for all the other videos in the series otherwise guys thanks for watching today's video and we will see you on the next one peace out nerds